Hey everybody out there, TGIF, it's Friday, and with Friday comes another mail day video. Today we got a bunch of mail over the last couple weeks. We're opening up this envelope first from JJZ. I entered a contest of his a few weeks ago. 50 subscriber contest video, and I won it. Tavares Daniels, right there, rookie card. He played for Notre Dame, drafted by the Vikings, played for the... Uh, Patriots briefly, and I do believe he's now in the CFL. Putting up good numbers in the CFL. Maybe he'll make his way back to the NFL. Maybe he'll make his way to the XFL. Note from Joey from JJZ. Go check out his channel. Give him a subscription. I'm sure he would appreciate it. He's probably going to have another contest here soon for 100 subscribers. So give him some love. He's a youngster out there making good videos. It's always good to encourage those guys to keep at it. Next, we have another contest victory from MetsFan311. I think I actually came in uh, second place on this uh, contest, but still won something. Let's see what I got here. Got a, got a couple of uh, jumbo packs of opening day. Got some singles over here. Now, we both have the same favorite team. Here's an Acuna. That's nice. We're both Mets fans, obviously, so I feel bad. Uh, he's, he probably had to dig into his personal collection to uh, supply my uh, contest winnings, but let's see what we got here. There's an Otani. Cody Bellinger. Gallery. Very nice. And I see some Mets over here. Seth Lugo there, a fire card. Oh, what do we have here? Seth Lugo, rookie, and there's an Ahmed Rosario. Another rookie, Dom Smith, gallery, tops gallery rookie. Very nice. Carlos Beltran, uh, relic. Nice, upper deck. Holy cow, 2005 relic. Lenny Dykstra, bat relic. All it's missing is a tobacco juice. Really nice. Beautiful. Oh, here's a Jeter, and there's a John Franco. Throwback to the 2000 World Series where the Mets face the all-steroid Yankees. I got to hand it to you, Mets fan 311. That's uh, Those are some tough decisions to make right there. I'm not sure I could have parted with any one of those cards. Really appreciate it, man. Very generous of you. Thank you very much. Check out these packs of tops opening day here. Make sure you go check out Mets fans 311 channel. He's always got some good content. He does some through-the-mail videos like I do. He opens up random packs as well, so he always makes his uh, videos entertaining. They're easy to watch, not too long. Let's see what we got here. 2019 opening day. You guys saw me open up a blaster box of this uh, a while ago. On opening day, actually. There's an Albies. Pool holes, Shamanaya, Severino, Arietta, Fultonavich. Here's the 150 Years of Fun cards. Opening day card. Now back to the base. Like El Franco, he's a pain in the pain in the neck for the Mets this year. There's a Jeff McNeil rookie. He's hitting 380 something right now. Syndergaard. All right. Check out this last pack here. I think I've entered probably 10 contests. I've won two of them. That's 20%, that's not bad. This contest was a 600 subscriber giveaway for MetsFan311. I will link up both of their channels in my description, so check them out. Michael Lorenzen, who might play some outfield this year. Might, might be our second two-way player, aside from Otani. There's a Chris Bryant. 
Chris Davis. It seems like I get a Chris Davis in every pack of cards I open. 150 Years of Fun. There's the Wizard of Oz, Ozzy Smith. There's Mr. Red. It's adorable. Ripping off the Met, Mr. Matt, I think. It's a Ryan O'Hearn Gold Cup. There's a Shohei Otani Gold Cup. Very nice. Justice Sheffield, rookie. The Yankees gave him up for uh, that pitcher, and I can't think of right now. Whit Merrifield and the uh, security tag. All right, guys, next we have a break. This was a random team break from Wicked Discounts. He does pretty good breaks. Make sure you guys check out his channel. And I did buy this Giselman on auction for $3.50, and I haven't paid him yet, so I better give him some money. Here is the box break. The two teams I won were the Royals and the Yankees, so I kind of lucked out there. was hoping it was the Mets, but it was the Yankees, so not bad. Could have been worse. I think they were two teams. I think they were 15 bucks, uh, and that was shipped, so I think I made out pretty good on here. Lots of Torres, lots of Judge base. There's a Stanton, another Torres, another Judge. And I did get a, uh, there's James Paxton, who I was talking about earlier. A few Royals here. Nobody to get excited about. The uh, Royals are doing dreadful this year. And I did get uh, one of the autos out of the box, so that was pretty exciting. One Diamond King. And uh, here's the auto, with Clint Frazier. Very nice. Pretty stoked to get that. Uh, Anduhar out of 42. Very nice as well. So that was that. Very well, much, well worth the 15 bucks, basically. That's what I'm trying to get out. Here's an eBay purchase. This is Tops Now. This is, this is tripping me out because uh, I just sold some cards and I did the same thing. I put it in the same plastic container and I put some penny sleeves in there to kind of fill the gap out so the cards didn't move around any so they did the same thing here I think I got five of these Peter Alonso first hit cards I've been doing all the Peter Alonso uh, or Pete Alonso as he wants to be called Pete Alonso uh, tops now cards so I've got four or five different ones now here they are all sleeved up flawless I'll send a few off to PSA I've got a few others I'm sending off the PSA, so print run was pretty high on these. I think the print run was over a thousand, so they're not going to be a bunch of money, but if he keeps it up and he has a decent career, they'll be they'll be decent. Here's another eBay purchase. This, of course, I totally forgot what this was, and this looks this is some vintage packing here. This looks like it's old, old cardboard. See what's in here. Even older cardboard, 1950 Bowman. So as you can see, I bought a 1951 Bowman and a 50 Bowman a few weeks ago for TTM purposes. And uh, you know that the set's not very expensive. I really kind of fell in love with these cards, and I figured, well, let's uh, shoot for a 1950 Bowman set. I mean, it shouldn't cost me a whole lot of money. I think I got these cards for four dollars a piece. I think there's a Bobby Thompson. He's the only guy in this uh, little bundle I got that I've heard of, but uh, pretty excited about it. And last but not least, everybody, 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 everybody. That's right. It's my monthly Jabs family Patreon package. That is three random packs of 2019, 18, or 17 cards. There's 2017 update. There's the Gypsy Queen 2019. It's also going to be two random cards. So I've got a Jim Tomey here, and I've got a random A's card on the back of this. I'm not quite sure who that is, but I'll find out here shortly. Let's open up this pack of opening day. This first card, Ronald Acuna Gold Cup. Very nice. Glaber Torres, the second Gold Cup card in a row. That's pretty cool. There's a Moncada. 
some shoddy editing there by me. Usually I'll stare at a card for 25 seconds and I'll watch the video and I'll be editing it and I'll be like, why did I look at that card for 25 seconds? So I cut that out and the editing software is a bit wonky sometimes. It uh, it lags a bit. It's a very uh, intense processing uh, situation. Apparently my computer, even though it's high end, can't handle it. So it does uh, it does some weird things. It's a little bit off. So every now and then I, I think I cut it good and then I go back and look at it. It's not cut good, but... It was an Acuna. Here is the update, which was uh, the sale, I guess, was the cool card in that pack. Not too much that'll, uh, not, not, nothing crazy in the 2017 update. Here's Gypsy Queen. Here's Chris Davis. I already made that joke about Chris Davis in every pack, right? Well, it seems like, uh, it seems like that's what happens. Chris Davis in every pack of cards I open. Maybe Chris Sale, uh, put him on that list too. It's a fortune teller card, pretty sweet. Jose Altuve, these are neat little cards. As long as they fit in the top loader, I don't care. Just don't make them bigger than a top loader, then we have problems. Looking at you, box toppers. Jeff McNeil, rookie, sweet. I put that in my rookies box. I've been getting stacks and stacks of uh, rookies and relics, and uh, I finally made a dedicated box just to kind of throw them in. And, uh,. I'll go back and sort them at a later date, but right now I just just I know that I got them all in there sorted. I kind of like uh, makes me feel better because otherwise they're just stacked on tables, which is uh, not the not the best way to store your cards. So not a real auto facsimile. Stephen Piscotti. Sorry, Stephen, I didn't know your name the first time around. I'm not sure what this card is. Maybe you guys can tell me. But anyway, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you to JJZ. And to Mets fan 311 JJZ, I'm not sure what the other J and the Z stand for, Joey, but I think those are your buddies, and I don't think they're making any videos or helping you out any, so you need to tell them to get on it, or you just, just change the name of your channel to Joey's channel and be done with it. And uh, go check him out, guys. He's got some great videos out there. Mets fan 311 also, great videos. Check him out as well. If you don't know who he is, you should know who he is. And hey, Bowman, 1950 Bowman, you Bowman fans out there. Uh, let me know what a, you know, a common Bowman 50 decent shape, you know, maybe excellent, uh, very good shape card will uh, will run you. I think I got those for three or four bucks. I think I see them for about three or four bucks, so I'm guessing that's about it. That Dykstra card's pretty sweet. You could probably get high if you smoked it. Uh, Dykstra's insane. You follow him on Twitter. Uh, it's an interesting follow. And, uh, yeah, that's it, guys. Bunch of mail. Bunch of mail I saved up. So, you guys have a great weekend. Thanks for watching. I'll be back Monday with a Through the Mail Monday. Got three returns this week. Pretty stoked about showing you guys who I got. And that's it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it. Return merchandise. Where's it at? Return goods. Sign and date. I'm just going to have you scan. So I don't know if those have been scanned as vacation.